to college is a luxury for many, especially in a crime-ridden city. We sat down with the stars of a new documentary called Step to find out just how they beat the odds in today's entertainment city. Step is a real-life documentary that follows a girls' step dance team through their senior year of high school. While working on perfecting their moves, the girls also strive to be the first in their families to go off to college against all odds of a troubled inner-city Baltimore. School is what got me out of Brooklyn. College is what's going to get you out of Baltimore. Terry Hart sat down with the cast to talk about what it was like going to the Baltimore Leadership School for Young Women, where 100% of the class went on to college. How many of your graduating class do you think would have gotten into college without that school? I'm not sure, honestly. Yeah. Our college counselor really played a huge role in all of our lives to get us to and through college. And also, I don't think getting into college would have been too much of a problem for some people, but getting through yes. college and like once you get accepted, that's just the beginning. What has STEP meant in each of your lives? Well, for me, STEP is a creative outlet. STEP is who I am. Without STEP, I really don't know where I would be. It taught me discipline, taught me leadership, teamwork, uh, to be courageous, to speak up about what you genuinely believe in. STEP helped me gain 19 sisters, well, 18 sisters. And I'm the only child, so I didn't really know how to share, how to adapt, how to be mindful of other people's feelings. And STEP really taught me how to do so. And I was always involved in like the academics of things. So I was on the debate team, like giving speeches and things like that. And STEP was really the first creative extracurricular that I ever gave a chance to. And I loved it. Another star who stepped her way into stardom and our hearts back in 2003, Jessica Alba. I like that. It flavors hot. Her moves in Honey were a hit, and so is her street style today as the ultimate mom to be. Tanya Kim caught up with stylist Afia Francisco for today's Fresh Edit to find out just how she does it. It is Friday Fresh Edit time, and it's also the middle of August, which means it's back to school. I mean, the kids aren't so excited, but I know the moms are. I'm excited. <laughs> Jessica Alba, mom on the go. Crazy entrepreneur. That's it. She's doing it all, and she always looks good doing it. I love this because this is the kind of outfit that you're going to go from running errands to work to pick up. It works really well for running around, but you look absolutely flawless. Again, with this moto jacket, love this faux leather. The bright blue is beautiful. So, Carolina Krakova, I've seen her rocking this look. She's a mom on the go and always looking so stylish. Always looks good, and really, I love this because it's all about essentials. We have that great moto jacket, but I love that it's in this new forest green. And then we have a classic t shirt and leather pants. So this is something that you're going to get endless use out of. Now we can't forget about the kids. It is back to school. It's all about the layering here. You want to think about what's going to work on the playground, what's going to work in the classroom, comfort, but also obviously always stylish. You know, and we can't not talk about this cute little bag. How cute is this, TK? The Freshers, they are the cutest crew going. <laughs> okay, so where can we find all these great looks? Of course, you can get everything in store and online at joefresh.com slash fridayfreshedit. And Step is currently playing in theaters at select Cineplex Cinemas. For more entertainment news, just follow us at N City. I'm Dina Pliaza. Entertainment City is brought to you by Joe Fresh. Friday Fresh Edit.